first thing you're going to want to do is join my discord i'll link it in the video description once you're in the discord go down to macro and download these two right so the auto hotkey 1.137.01 the setup exe and the zip file you can also go to download and find both of them there right <coughs> once you set up the auto hotkey file it's gonna look like this download this one once you download this one it's gonna look like like this right it's this one just right click it do extract here and all of these files will pop up right like all of these and this one stuff like that right once you have both of those, everything will basically be fine. All you got to do then is download these macros for auto hotkey, right? So download the all macros zip, which is going to look like this. I named it macro, but you can just name it whatever you want. So same thing, just right click, extract here, which is for me, I already have it. So it's going to tell me this, the macro. Is the Garfield's Asura macros without webhook, right? So I'm gonna show you. It has all the macros, right? So this one is this one. For pull-ups, so for the Dura pull-ups, I have another macro because I don't really like the Garfield pull-up macro. It's called Asura pull-ups main. Now you don't need this one. You can also use this one. It's just preference, I guess. <clears throat> but you can also download this one. If you don't want to use the file, just go to the website. Click on code, click on download zip, and then it'll be downloaded, right? Same thing again, right click, extract here, and you'll have this. That's all you have to do. Then just go into your game, go, for example, strike power, just position yourself right like this. Some tips, right? <coughs> your brawl has to be in one, always. Uh, in the second slot, I recommend like a phone or just a move or anything in general. And then in three, four, five, six, and seven, have your food. So have all the food in the game and make sure you're always max hunger before you start, right? Then on eight or R for me, put your strike power. So your strike power and then in T and Y, just do whatever or have nothing. Doesn't really matter what you have here, right? Then. Go over to your file explorer click on garfield's macro macros and then just do let's see strike power macro and then go for strike power your screen is going to minimize <coughs> because that's the only way that uh the program recognizes what it has to do basically right make sure your chat is closed don't have this open so make sure this is gray like kind of see through your tab doesn't really matter and now all you have to do is hover your mouse over strike power training and then just click K. And now it's gonna eat if it's hungry or just start to strike power whenever necessary. So as you can see, it's just gonna macro and you can leave this on as long as you want. Just refill your food every four hours or so, I think two to three, I say. To leave the macro, just click L. And that's it. Same thing applies for, for example, durability. So the dura pull-ups, then it's gonna be this one. So just take this one. So go to this. So the pull-ups main, dura pull-up. I would recommend clicking on the bar first, then click leave so you have like a better position. Zoom in a tiny bit, hover over the bar, click K, and it's just gonna do your durability. Again, if you want to leave, click L and just click leave. Same thing applies for all the rests. For example, speed macro or stamina macro. Just go back to Garfield's macros and let's say stamina, right? So stamina, just leave better position. And then you have this open, hover over the treadmill, K, and then it's just going to run automatically for you. Then there's another pretty important one, I'd say, which is the muscle macro, right? So take muscle macro, 
This one's a little bit simpler than all the strike power and all that stuff. You just take whatever you want to train. So let me say I want to do push-ups. Just put it whatever you want. And just stand still like this. Now take the Garfield muscle. Double click it. It's going to minimize again. And now all you have to do is just click K. It's going to automatically recognize the push-up or the squat or the setup. But make sure it's only one at a time. Because if you put multiple, it's not going to be able to recognize what it has to do. So if I want to train squats and it takes push-ups, for example, you don't want that. See, because now it's taking squat while I, for example, wanted push-ups. And that's about all you have to know for the macros. That about wraps up the video. If there's any questions or you need help with the macro, be sure to let me know in the comments or just uh, message me on Discord. For those that watched all the way to the end, uh, I'm going to give away 10,000 AC. Uh, so just comment your Roblox username or why you want it. Just anything really. And I'm just going to make like a raffle or like a spinning wheel and then I'll pick the person that won.